election does not make up that shortfall, there will be cuts. The state legislature is not here. Uh, I can only respond to the shortfall if we don't receive the federal funding. And I believe it would be so ludicrous to have taken the actions they have taken, where they're funding big business, small business, airlines, they're worried about hotels, they're worried about restaurants, and I'm not debating those issues. But then not to help schools and police and firefighters and give people food who are starting to snack? I mean, how could you ever justify that? On a moral basis, ethical basis, legal basis, uh, political basis, I don't care. How do you, how would you ever justify that? Yes. Okay, the nice day. I'm going to go out and get some. And we've been listening to Governor Andrew Cuomo here on 1010 when he announced 157 new deaths in the last day, 52 of them in nursing homes. He said that number is right about where we were at the beginning of the pandemic. The uh, governor also talked about perhaps opening sports for fanless activities, specifically racing, horse racing, maybe even baseball for television audiences only. He did not give a time frame for that. He did say elective surgeries would be allowed to resume in Westchester and Suffolk counties. He also said it's critical that people wear masks and wear them correctly as the weather warms up. Wind news time, 12.04. Well, it is a nice day and people are heading out to the parks. Social distancing is, of course, a challenge, but will they wear masks like they're supposed to to protect others now that the NYPD is dialing back enforcement on masks? School safety officers have been handling out, handing out masks in Central Park where Fred is walking his dog near the middle. Nobody's actually totally safe because there's stuff that's out of our control, but um, I think being out in the sunshine is nice. Being outside is better than being inside. when somebody doesn't want anyone near them and you stay away from them. Mm. Not so bad. The police department has been criticized over the instances of harsh, harsh social distancing enforcement. And Mayor de Blasio said yesterday it will no longer be involved in breaking up small clusters of people or confronting citizens about failing to wear a mask or not wearing the mask properly. De Blasio says the police will keep dispersing large gatherings that are most likely to risk spreading the virus. And let's check that 1010 Winds AccuWeather forecast. It is beautiful out today, mostly sunny, getting up to 78 degrees in Central Park. Tonight, partly to mostly cloudy, or partly cloudy, that is, and comfortable with a low of 54 degrees. Tomorrow, some sunshine in the morning, fading behind increasing clouds by only 66 degrees. And we do expect some showers later tomorrow night. Monday, cloudy and cool with a few showers, high 63 and Tuesday. The cooling trend continues with periods of rain high only 58 on Tuesday. Right now it's 68. We have a fair sky, the relative humidity at 50.